want to say thank you, Riley, for letting us steal your bat for the day. Uh, greatly appreciated, Mr. Velvet. We're going to hit some dingers right now. What's up guys, it's Ben, back from my short hiatus of being out of my home state, and I am back with a new review video. Today I'm going to be talking about one of the more infamous bat brands in the football community, and that is Moonshot. Been waiting a while to try these bats out, and this video has been a long time coming, so let's not waste any more time and get into it. So, Moonshot is most definitely the upper echelon of wiffle ball bats on the market. For the player that has everything, why not spend a couple hundred dollars on a bat, right? Now, this bat actually belongs to Riley Viator of my league, SPW, but it's quickly turning into a favorite to use by other players, including myself, actually. This bat is the Moonshot Revolution Model EFX, which is the heaviest bat the company makes, weighing between 11 and 13 ounces, and coming in 2.5 and, and 2 and 3 quarters inch barrel widths. Options for length goes from 34 to 36 inches, and let me tell you, those extra few inches of length give you a lot of help with crushing those outside pitches. Now, out of the other bats I've talked about on this channel before, I can definitely say that Moonshot comes with the most bells and whistles. Whether it's choosing the bat's color or even a two-tone option, being able to select your lizard skin grip color slash pattern, and even being able to put a customizable text on the bat itself, which, <laughs> yep, yeah, Riley, I gotta say, man, pr pretty solid. And even besides that, the one year warranty and free shipping are two more pluses for Moonshot's side. I think as a company, Moonshot's biggest selling point is making bats that feel incredibly specific to the buyer, instead of just buying another plastic bat from your local sporting goods store. And honestly, I think it's a good thing. It definitely caters to the wants of a committed, pro whiff player, but I love the idea of having a company to cater to that market, which there really aren't that many out there. However, bells and whistles aside, the bat in and of itself is incredibly solid overall. I already mentioned the high amount of weight for this bat, but honestly, this extra weight to me helps your swing feel a little more solid and controlled, like you have a little more punch behind it, if you will. The elastic fiberglass material that makes up the bat doesn't give or flex like the plastic of a loco bat, for example. In fact, when you make contact with the ball, you really don't feel much of anything in the way of resistance or bending of the plastic. However, despite the weight and solid material, the bat actually is tapered in such a way to give you a very good bat speed. Your swing still feels very fluid when you make contact, but it doesn't feel as clunky as it can with other bats when you actually hit the ball. Fall backwards on three. Ready? One, two, three. Overall, this Moonshot EFX bat is an absolute blast to hit with, and really gives you an experience that I can't exactly compare to other bats I've previously reviewed because Moonshots are really just an animal all their own. Now, for a price tag of $155 for this model, which is also their least expensive, I doubt many of you are going to go out and buy one today. However, for the dedicated players wanting to add to the collection or just looking for a new bat to get them out of a slump and punish hitters with, Moonshot to me is right up your alley. It costs a pretty penny, but it delivers on its promise as the premier pro wiffle ball bat. That's about going to wrap it up for this video, fellas. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you're interested in checking out Moonshot's other model bats or just some of their other products like shirts or caps, I've linked their website down below, so definitely be sure to check those guys out. It's an awesome company. And as always, if you like what I do and want to support the channel, please drop a like and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it. Also, if you have an opinion on Moonshot, drop it down below. Please add to the knowledge pool on these bats on this video because I'm sure some of you watching have been using these bats way longer than me, so uh, please let me know your opinion. I'm going to close out the video here, fellas. Get out there, enjoy summer, and play some whiff, and I'll be talking to you guys soon. Goodbye.
Moonshot. Yep. <laughs>